Kazakhstan is. Kazakhstan is exactly how you can imagine it to be. Flat, small little towns and villages. In certain parts the road was very good and other parts of the road were completely destroyed. I'm in Kazakhstan and driving Mercedes-Benz G500 through the fields and dust. I'm not sure if I'm legible here or not because I have only New Zealand driver license, not even Russian. So, but I think we will be cool. Climbing up to 8,000 meters will be tiring, but trying to cross the border in between Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan took the whole day today. We drove through the night over 1,100 kilometers. Then it took us over 14 hours to go from Kazakhstan to Uzbekistan to this restaurant. I think now we are double happy. We appreciate food much more because we spent all day waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and we did not even know if we will be able to leave Kazakhstan today and enter the Uzbekistan today. You kept in this cage without ever knowing when you're going to get out. I don't know what has happened to the world today that we still treat people a little bit like animals. You see how friendly people are. They will give me their bread to eat. And about half an hour ago, we were stuck in no man's land with nothing to eat and to drink. People have always asked me what exploration has taught me. Today, I can honestly say that exploration taught me a lot of patience and I'm ready for the next lesson down the road.